What's up, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to another Terraria Let's Play today. It's honestly been a hot minute since I've been here, but um, in a quick recap, last episode, I believe we absolutely annihilated the um, Eye of Cthulhu multiple times. Four times, apparently, actually. Let me fix this up. I can't stand this. This is, like, not, not right. They need to be next to each other. Perfect. There we go. Next one. Okay, cool. So, yeah. So, we managed to defeat the Eye of Cthulhu. We got my absolute favorite accessory, the Shield of Cthulhu, which allows us to now dash, which is absolutely amazing. I absolutely love the dash ability. It's great. So, now that we've done that, we really need... I mean, we've got plenty of bars, but we also need the scales in order to make a new pick because we've got a, only a silver pick. So, we kind of need a better pick. So, in order to do that, we need to fight the next boss. So, I think what my plan is to possibly fight the next boss this episode or just prepare for it, at least. So, what we're going to do, since we are a ranger, I'm just going to try and shop here. We've got a metric ton of gold now, so I'm actually going to buy a mini shark. Now, main reason for that is because, well, hey, we need the range. But, um, actually, no, that's really it. We just need the range. We really need the range. And this does ton well, enough damage, at least, to enemies. So, case in point, we can just shred that little vulture right there. Ah! It's too good. Do we have any? No, we just got standard mini shark. Okay, that that's fine. That's fine. Ultimately, I'd like to make a star cannon as well. But, eh, we don't really have that much gold yet. And I don't exactly need it for the next boss fight. So, the next boss fight is going to actually be in the Crimson. So, that's probably our best Crimson right there. Because I don't think we've really been to other Crimson. So, that's going to be over here. So, I'm going to make my way over there. And I'm going to start trying to flesh out an area. I mean, it's got a nice open area to begin with. We're going to try and, like, I don't know, knock it out a little bit more. Add a few things in, like some um, regen stations and stuff like that. So some campfires. Um, our little trick with the honey pots, which hopefully I have honey. Can't remember if I do or if I don't. But we're going to do that. Hopefully we'll be able to shred this thing. Hopefully. <laughs> um, and that'll get us a new pick. And then we can start looking at doing uh, probably a hell run. So we can go down to hell after that and get um, some nice ores from hell. Because that's going to be our next big upgrade is armor as well. Because this armor that we've got is pretty, it's pretty meh. I'll be honest. We we could be we could be better kitted out. So let's let's get down in there and we'll see what we're working with. All right. So by the looks of it, we definitely do have a pretty nice open area. I'm gonna need to light it up a bit and get rid of stupid stuff. Oh god, stay away from me. And get rid of stupid stuff that we built previously, like this wooden monstrosity here, that obviously to protect ourselves. That we didn't made earlier. But yeah, I think we should probably open it up a little bit more. Just just a tad. And then then place down a few things. And we have a decent little boss boss area here that should go pretty well. The only problem is the next boss is it's not like incredibly hard, but it's it's definitely a bit harder just because of the amount of crap that spawns. Oh yeah, go walk straight into that. Nice. Oh god. So it's gonna be it's gonna be a test of skill, that's for sure. For us, especially given um uh given our armor and weapons that we have, which are okay but not the greatest. It should be interesting. Also, Jesus, these things are spawning like crazy right now. What is the go? My god. Okay, let's jump back in here. Okay, so I'm gonna need to spend some time really just decking this area out. So what I might do is I might try and clear out a bit more of an area for us and put down a few spots to heal and then we'll go from there and we'll see just if we can actually take on this boss and see if we can actually win. So I shall be back shortly. Much, much, much later. Okay, so it's been a hot minute, but I'm just about ready to put the finishing touches on our little boss arena slash battle arena that we have. And hopefully... Fingers crossed, it'll be good enough for us to actually defeat the boss and then get the upgraded weapon. And by upgraded weapon, I mean the new pickaxe. Because we need that better pickaxe in order to go down to hell so we can mine and get better armor and so on and so forth. So basically, we're just going for hunting for some upgrades. So well, the boss that we're actually fighting, which I totally just realized I never actually explained what it was, is the Brain of Cthulhu. So it's basically... 
like the brain version of the eye of cthulhu i wonder if they'll i mean all the updates in this game are done but it'd be kind of cool if they had like every body part of cthulhu that'd be kind of cool uh anywho um let's get in there oh wait is this my little yeah it is okay this is my little entrance here let's jump down i'll show you what i've done so basically i've cleared out the area a little bit i made a few platforms and we made it look nice kind of so this is it here so we basically blown up this area a bit and some of the side walls a little bit more just so i got a bit more room to run around in and basically this is how we plan to fight no oh god this is how i plan to fight the boss will it go well i'm not too sure but that's my plan now i did make these jumps a little bit higher than what i probably should have like it would probably be better if they're a little bit lower but you know i'll make do now one annoying thing about this area is my god the spawns of zombie the spawns of actual enemies is ridiculous here but i've got some honey we're gonna place the honey bam give us that nice little regen let's place one in here as well two in there so now every time you see the honey status effect every time we run into it we get it which is always good and i can just sprint across there and get it again it's amazing so this should be enough for us to hopefully beat it will we be strong enough i don't know especially with all these mobs spawning it's gonna get a little bit annoying now i do want to have jester arrows as well so i think i'm gonna use a bow for a decent portion of this just mainly because it it rips through the enemies and if spoiler alert if you haven't seen this boss there are tons of mini eyes that float around that we need to kill originally before we actually start attacking the boss so that is the plan now i've totally realized that i don't have any potions on me slight mistake as the endless freaking hordes come after me here it's ridiculous so i'm just gonna quickly jump back we'll grab whatever potions we have now we do have some left over that i put in a chest yeah we've got an iron skin a regeneration i'll grab that thorns potion oh we got another iron skin um night owl might as well swiftness beauty actually they're basically all the things that we will really need um i wouldn't mind getting a well-fed buff i don't know if i have any fish have i been fishing in here man i can't I can't even remember the worlds blend together um no i don't oh wait maybe do i have a jungle area in here no no not that i built okay i'm literally thinking of a different world god damn it that's okay this is fine this is fine we can make do um is there anything i can make to make food i don't think there is oh we're just gonna go what we got should be good enough we've got 80 jester arrows actually how do i make more jester arrows i know i need these don't exactly remember what else guide tell me what i need enchanted bay no no there you go oh it's literally just that okay well that's easy we've got that in spades okay let's just arrows bang let's make a few of those 390 that should be plenty we now have like a zero fallen stars that's okay i'm gonna quick stack some stuff iron skin i still got my potions okay okay look i'm feeling confident i am feeling confident i'm gonna stack up our weapons like this just so we have oh let me just click on that wait that's a demonic tendon bow yeah yeah that's that's the one from that's the upgraded bow i think that's the highest bow that we can get i believe at the current stage of what we have we will be able to upgrade it soon so i've got my three main weapons we're gonna be rocking an unreal broom broomstick god we're a witch now <laughs> No, okay so we got our unreal boomstick the demonic tendon bow and then a mini shark this should hopefully make light work of the enemies hopefully i don't know how we're gonna go to be honest but we'll figure it out oh god i've gone down the wrong area we'll figure that out as we go now we do need to summon the boss now i don't have the actual summon for the boss however if we break another shadow orb that will automatically summon the boss so that's what i'm gonna try and do probably should have prepped a shadow orb beforehand so we had one ready to go but you know that'd be smart and i'm a bit of a dupe dupe bit of a dolt that's okay let's 
I know there's one down here. I think, yeah, there's one over there. Oh, uh, is there any... Like, open one? Oh, there you go. There's an open one. Um, let's quickly make a bomb. Alright, let's just throw this here. Let's run back up and let's hope for the best. Okay, the boss has spawned. Oh, okay, here he is. Now, we're already going to get attacked. Oh, we'll see? And this is what I mean by we, we need to... Oh, God. This is going to be a terrible battle. Ugh. Okay. Let's just get through these. So, this is what I mean by he has tons of eyes. So, we need to keep doing damage to these and kill these things. Oh, God. Um, and get them all killed before we do any damage to the actual boss. I've just realized I've got low as health. Um, and there's a worm there. Oh, God. This is not going well. This is not... Okay, so that went terribly. That went really terribly. Ooh, I don't know what we're going to need. We're going to have to somehow increase our damage output. I'm not exactly sure what we could do to do that, though. I might need to make a bigger arena, but let me just think. I don't know what to do, to be honest. This is crazy. Um... Hmm. Yeah, that didn't go to plan. We did get a banner, though. That's... That's... Woo! <laughs> God damn it. Okay. Well, I might... See, do we have enough stuff to make it again? I just want to see if I can make another one. No, I think we're going to have to make the arena bigger, to be honest. And possibly go mining to get some better armor. Because we is hella underpowered for that boss. My God. God, I can't do anything to it. I guess we did, like, looking on the bright side, we did get it to almost half health. So, we did actually kind of do okay. But I'm just going to need to clear out that area even more so we've got more of a runway to run. And hopefully decrease enemy spawns somehow. Because these spawns in here are harsh. That's really what kind of killed us a lot. That and the fact that we don't have any great mobility items. Like, we still feel really slow. Even though we've got all these items here. I just feel so slow. But let's let's just try and, like, break this up a bit. And, like, open up a bit more area. Because that might help. M maybe. Also might get us killed quicker. Nah, it shouldn't get us killed quicker. I doubt that would happen. But yeah, the problem is all these enemies. My god, like... Look at them. I just got here, and there's already about 18,000 of them. Jesus. Okay, so at least we've got some kind of a platform that we can work from. And the healing does work well. Okay, let's just keep bombing this area. And just see what we can do. Um, we might need to make these little runways longer as well. Oh, no, the bombs didn't work. Actually, those bombs worked really well. On accident. That's kind of funny. Because, yeah, my idea is that we'll probably need a longer runway so we can actually, I don't know, just run side to side a bit easier. Because at the moment, us trying to do that vertical jump ain't too great. What is on my head? There is literally one block here. My god. Oh, okay, um, let's just blow this up too. Uh, oh god. See, these guys hit like tanks too. My god. They just shred. We're meant to be the ones doing the shredding, but it ain't the case. Okay, um... I don't know what else I can do, really. Also, do we have another three orbs, or am I gonna have to try and, like, make... make one of the boss summoning items? I might have to make one. That'll be interesting. Um... I kind of just want to give it another shot and just see how I go. I really need to make more potions, though. That's so much work. God damn, I'm so lazy. Okay. Here's what I think we should do. I think what I should do is reconvene. Because at the moment, there's just too many, too many mobs and shit. Oh god, oh god. Oh god, the bombs are gonna go off. Jesus. I think there's too many mobs in here. Especially since we're so close to a jungle. I think that does make it a little bit harder for me. Considering we're still very weak and underpowered. We're like little baby. Let's just open this up as much as we can. Before I die. Because I'll inevitably die. God, I'm already low health. And then... 
What I think we can do... I don't know. See, there's no, like, real good armor that we can get. That's the annoying thing. Oh. Okay. Oh, God. Man. Okay, so this is definitely more open already. Obviously. Yeah. Oh, God. Oh. Yep, I died. Okay, cool. We've opened that up a little bit more. Let's see, is there anything that we can do? Or should I just try and fight it again? I might just try and fight it again. Stuff it, you know? See how we go. Um, let me just see what potions that we have left. Oh, God. What potions do we have? Heal me. Heal me, nurse lady. Okay, so... Oh, you know what? Archery potion would have been smart. Hunter potion wouldn't be too bad. Damn, how did I miss those? That's stupid of me. Um, we've got an iron skin. We've got a sweetness. I just really need a regen potion. I've got some vile mushrooms to call it in again. Um, uh, regen. How do I make a regen potion? Guide! Guide, tell me. How do I make a regen? Um, oh, God damn it. I don't even have any of my ingredients. Um, where are my mushrooms? Go away, lady. Mushrooms. There they are. Okay, Mr. Guideman, tell me, how do I make... How doth I make a regen potion? It's day bloom water and that. Okay, that's that's easy. Um, we've got water somewhere. There's water. The day blooms should be in here. I believe there's day blooms in here. Is there no day blooms? Damn it, Bobby. Um, there might not be no day blooms. Dang it. Okay, I'm gonna have to go on a quick quest for some day blooms, even though it's turning night, I think. Yep, I'm gonna go on a quick quest for that, and then we'll make our regen potion, and then we'll give it another shot. So, we'll see how we go. Okay, regen potions galore. Okay, that should be it. I would try and get the well fed buff, but that's a lot of work. Because I need to buy a fishing rod and go fish. I don't think I have one. Actually, let me check. Is it. Where's my little thing? I don't know where my thing. Oh, maybe I don't have it on this character. Damn it! I just keep thinking of things that I've got on other characters and not on this one. Oh, well, I'm just going to assume that we don't have one. Because I'm too lazy to go check. If, if we fail here, then I'll go I'll, I'll go all out. I'll get fishes. I'll get everything that we need to definitely combat them in the future. I'm also going to take that day bloom really quick. Okay, so hopefully this works. Now, we do have the ingredients that we need to make the summoning item as well. Because I've got 20 vertebrae. I've got some mushies. There you go. Vicious mushrooms. Should be fine. That should be enough. Hopefully to get that all done. Now, I am also going to... Oh, damn, that's my... No, that's not my tunnel. I keep trying to... I keep forgetting what's my tunnel to get in and not. I, I probably should also, like, make a bit more of an area there, but... Like, and build extra blocks, but that's a lot of work. Again, I'm fighting the laziness here. It's crazy. Oh, God. Wow, that... Oh, I don't have my right weapon equipped. He just hit me like a truck. Jesus Christ. Okay, I've got a minute for that to wear off. Um, for the moment, let's find... Where is my vial powder? Oh, can I not make vial powder here? <sighs> Damn it. I'll be back again. Okay. Now I should be able to make it because I've got my vicious powder. There you go. Bloody spine. Bang. Okay, we made one. Now let's just quickly run down. Let me, let me affix some lights over here. So there's at least some lights so I can see. And then I think, I think this will work. I kind of want to keep these red slimes here too, just because they're, they're a lot easier to deal with than the bloody crawlers and stuff like that. I love how I call them bloody crawlers, not because their name is blood crawler, but just because like Australian, right? Okay. Let's, let's clear these guys out really quick. Let's get a nice little, oh my God, that just spawned so many more. All right. Let's just, let's just YOLO it. Let's see how we go. Okay. We have called him in and there he is. Okay. Let's, let's just do some damage. All right, all right. This is a bit easier. We're a bit more open. We can we can do some damage a bit more comfortably, without having to worry as much. I'm okay with this. I'm okay with this so far. Okay, we need to keep track of the bloody mobs, like you guys, because they seem to be more of an issue. Oh god, 
Okay, so that 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 is what we need to avoid doing that. And letting it come this close to you. This we need to avoid as well. Okay, let's just rotate around. Let's call up a heal. Oh god, I just ran into it. Oh god. Oh god. Now, here is one thing we can do as well that I've just realized. Oh god, this is actually quite bad. Can you all die, please? Okay, huh? Oh god, no. Oh god. God damn it, we got stuck down there. Oh, that's so annoying. Ah, we, well, we did more damage this time. That's always good. We would have been fine too if I didn't get stuck down there. God damn it. Oh, this bus sucks. I hate, I, I like the other bus better. Oh, well, it's okay. Now, one thing I was going to say, I did realize if we kill these guys, we still get tissue samples, which is actually the thing that we need to make the pickaxe. And maybe, just, just maybe... We have enough to build... <gasps> we do. We've got enough to build the actual pickaxe. Haha. Then we can get some upgrades. So what am I do? Well, I'll save this here for now. We'll reconvene in the next episode. Because hopefully we should be able to go down to hell once we get that pickaxe. And then we should be able to absolutely kick that boss's ass. So I'll see you guys in the next episode. Be sure to get subscribed if you haven't already. Like the video if you liked it. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. <laughs>